Hello, YouTube family. I'm Patty Jackson, Auntie Ginger. Yeah, I'm adopting <laughs> Auntie Ginger. I like it. This is Latoya Charleston, <laughs> Chocolate Divinity. You got chocolate, you got ginger, <laughs> and we got food. Today is Mardi Gras. Mm -hmm. Jack. Got our beads. Yes. I love to cook. I made toy. I made toy. I said, Toy, you're going to have a Mardi Gras experience. We got bread pudding that I make mm -hmm. in a crock pot. And that, listen. In a crock it's a real pot. Crock and it pot. comes out. You do the different settings. Yes. And then we got some Ooh. turkey sausage, shrimp, crab meat, little crab legs. Ooh. Yeah. You're going to eat good. You're going to love it. You're going to love it. And I made a big pot of gumbo last night. I just had a good time in the kitchen. There you go. I did. I oh, just had. But you I can just tell had. because it's in. You taste it in the food how much you love to cook. Yo. So, and we are thankful for it. And my root <laughs> came out great. I said, let me yes. go down there to New Orleans. <laughs> get get me a man down there. Yeah, yes, I can cook this bag. Yeah, I can cook this. <laughs> Lizzo is coming out with a line of thongs. This is on her dream list. The NAACP mm -hmm. Entertainer of the Year loves to wear thongs. And she wants to team up with Tommy Hilfiger, and guess what? Tommy wants to team up with her. What? Are you thinking just, about that Lakers game? No. Yeah, that's part of it. But I thought women, we were getting rid of thongs a while ago. Your monkey. It, I didn't think they were sanitary for your monkey. You know, the thing ride up back and forth. That ain't healthy. Can you just, like... I guess it on for five minutes before you get <laughs> For your man in the pole, but I hope y'all not just out here just Yeah, there. Lizzo wants to Get yeah. your money, Lizzo. I'm not mad at you. Steven Spielberg, we told <laughs> you about the famed director. Yeah. Greatest movies. Mm -hmm. Close Encounters, Jaws, Schindler's mm -hmm. List. I mean the list goes on and on and on with the great Steven Spielberg movies. Yes. His adopted daughter going into porn. We were like he Girl. down with this? And she claimed that he was. Very accepting of it. My parents support me. No. He's very embarrassed. As he should be. He is extremely embarrassed about this. I'm like, what they child doing that? Because they're thinking, this is not how we raised you. No. You were adopted, but this is not how you were raised. Mm -hmm. And they're wondering the effects of their other children watching her do this. Now, apparently, mm -hmm. Chocolate, you got to explain this to me. Okay. She has some app where people pay her money and they can watch her. I can see, like a webcam girl. So, I... I I don't know if she's using PayPal or she could be using Venmo. I don't know how she has it set up, but people spend their money to watch you do sexual acts online. Not that I visited. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I visited these things. Well, I run one myself. well, just, well just, Steven Spielberg is your daddy. I ain't doing nothing. What? You can be doing a lot. This box is all the way put away. Help, you ain't seeing none of it. Help help humanity. Thank you. See what's going work your dad. Get you a boutique. Now we done told you. Yeah, but she don't want to listen. The ESPN you. documentary on Dwayne Wade, mm -hmm. Life Unexpected, he does go into detail about his first marriage, and he admits he married way too young. They were babies. They were babies when yeah. they got married. The divorce was very nasty. She lost custody of yeah. the kids. There are many stories about what happened, and yep. apparently people don't like when I say crazy. You can't say crazy. Um, it's not politically correct if you say crazy. Okay, what are we going to Tink, tink. Tink, tink. Because we all know it ain't not everybody got look. I got crazy. In my I got some. I do, too. You just got to call it like it. Tink, tink. It doesn't mean, I mean, I guess, you know, for people, if you took it insensitive, we apologize. He, he was very open in this documentary, though. About his first marriage, um, his parents on drugs, getting wow. into basketball, of course, meeting Gabrielle Union, marrying mm. her, having an outside baby. So it, it's Ooh. it's ESPN, D-Wade life unexpected. Okay. R. Kelly and his wife, Drea, are getting a divorce. Yeah. And the divorce, not yet. I would have thought they were divorced already. His, his lawyers are mean. They want her to stop being a freeloader. But she got three kids. She needs Thank some money. You. She needs that some woman, money. And they done canceled Hollywood Divas, whatever it was called. She I was know. on that show. Yeah, but they've been haggling over stuff, but that that mm -hmm. is still going on. The Voice returned. Mm -hmm. Nick Jonas is there with oh. Blake Shelton okay. and Kelly Clarkson and John Legend. But mm -hmm. the ratings were low. Mm -hmm. Yep, the ratings were low. And I'm, I'm this this is my opinion. Mm -hmm. We've never seen a superstar come out of the voice. Yes. They win 
you never hear from me nope. again. I thought you were making stars. And yeah. they got people in there that can sing. That's so funny. They I, have people there that have they can. great voices. Yep. Yep. I think the voice, I think it was, unlike, like we're American Idol for a while, it was always about the talent. Yeah. The voice, it became more about the judges and their okay. celebrities. So maybe people are just kind of stick, sick of that shtick. Like, y you want real talent coming out of these shows now. Yeah, can y'all just have one that mm -hmm. can, like, top the charts? Yep. Like BTS? Yes. So wait, so I'm watching Jim, Late Night Jimmy Fallon mm -hmm. last night. So they do this thing to run the MCs that's tricky. They kill which, which was my song mm -hmm. years ago. But people were acting like it was new. I said, you know, 80s. Really new. But this is the end. Can you not knowing? Yes. Yes. It ain't you Tina, not knowing. Tina Fey. She's from this area, Upper Darby. Mm -hmm. Saturday Night Live. She did great Sarah Palin. Yep. She was trending because people didn't know who she was. I was like. Wait. What? Yeah. 30 Rock? Yeah. Mean 30 Girls? Rock, mean Girls. I was like. But yeah, the run DMC is tricky, and I'm like, that's not a new song. <laughs> Remember when um, was it the Super Bowl performance where the, they brought Missy Elliott out? Yeah, and nobody know who she was. I know. And I'm like, who raised y'all? Yeah. What is happening in yeah, life that you don't, don't know who because these people, people are? because people are in their own bubble. People are in their own Ooh. bubble, and they don't really care what happens with this group of people mm -hmm. or that one. You know, we be knowing everything yes. about, we don't care what color you are, it's we like, going to know. Into it. Yeah. But you know what? Y'all get it together. Tricky is a it, 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 it is an original 80s Run DMC right. song. See, so on. Stop. It's a classic. Yes, it is. It's a classic. <laughs> well, The Voice return, to get back to The Voice, mm -hmm. to low ratings. They need to have a winner. It was beaten by The Bachelor. I can't stand that show. Yeah. I can't. I can't stand The Bachelor. I don't think there'll ever be a Black Bachelor because no. it'll be too much, too much, too much controversy. Same, same. And then they always have like the Psycho Girls always on there, mm -hmm. and it's like it's too much. Yeah, I think I made the watch one full season and was done after that. Meanwhile, American Idol has returned to great ratings. Oh. Katy Perry, Lionel yes. Richie, yes, Luke Bryant. The ratings for mm -hmm. American Idol. I don't know if it's close to Sunday night. But the ratings have been great. Yeah, Harvey Weinstein. So he get he he's guilty. Two of the five counts. Mm -hmm. They say you gotta go to jail. He walked. He didn't use this walker. Oh. He did not use you remember I was coming in the corner. Yeah, he can happened? barely walk. He's got the walker. What happened, bro? He ditched the walker. But oh. once he got into the van, he started having heart palpations. And they thought he was having a, a heart attack. So they had to make a stop. They're sending him to Rikers Island. I don't. Maybe it was the hearing Rikers Island uh -huh. that made him say, "Breathe and yeah. get in this car, and we're yeah. going to drop you off at prison." Yeah. Um, sentencing is March 11. He still okay. has the LA trial. He's afraid of dying in prison. He says his kids need him. Isn't everybody afraid of dying in prison? Yeah. <laughs> you did the but crime. You, but you go to Rikers though. It's like y'all sending me there. Ain't playing. Ooh. Now Bill Cosby weighs in. He in the country club, prison in Pennsylvania. Eating jello, eating pudding pops. <laughs> What's up, Harvey? He said, um, it's a it's a miscarriage of justice. I don't get into the cancer culture, but Bill, Bill Cosby, stop. Stop, stop it, stop, stop it, stop, stop it. Stop. Blind leading the blind. Yeah. For even, real. Even, even though I think that you, you got screwed and that's mm -hmm. why you're in prison, but I also think it's karma. Thank you. I think it is karma. I think what has happened to him is karma. Mm -hmm. Your legacy, everything, down the drain, great show, mm -hmm. but apparently a two two different lives, and he was so critical. Yeah. He sure was. He so be was doing that critical. much dirt in your I personal know. life, for you to have that much criticism toward Job, people he is been insane quiet. to me. Be quiet. Yeah. Just I saw I saw an interview D.L. Hughley did with the uh, Breakfast Club. Okay. He said it was a known. It was known that he would give women pills. I said it was known. Like they knew. Like this was. Mm. Yeah. What was up? So yeah. so basically, if a woman was messing with him, she would have known that yeah. that's how he gets down. But they said this. It, this was not a secret, and then everything came out. Ooh. Meanwhile, they say Harvey was very mad because he was body shamed. Nubs. Yeah, nubs. Um, with, with they said it was with his testicles and inverted. It was crazy. Ooh. Yeah, mm. but they said he was very mad that they body shamed him. Why would they bring that up? 
Well, why would they bring that up? You know what's so crazy to me? How he's so offended by this, but being the, the mega producer that he was, I'm mm -hmm. sure he was behind a lot of body shaming. A lot oh of women gosh. who couldn't get yes. jobs because yes. they didn't fit, fit in a perfect package. Exactly. And look at you, trifling, looking like Shrek, with uglier. That, with all that hair on your back. Ugh. Yeah. Ugh. Little pee pee. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody watch Red Table Talk with Jade and Snoop? Mm. Okay, y'all know I'm petty. I, I want Gail to apologize. I'm sorry. I Hello. want Gail to apologize. Y'all gonna keep dragging Snoop. Yes, he but he went he went overboard. Mm -hmm. We need Gail to apologize. Thank you. And Jada, I like you. I like you a lot, but y'all got stuff in your own backyard. Y'all dragging Snoop like this. That's all I'm gonna say. And I like that too. And I just say that I like it, but I didn't like. Uh, I was like, mm, it's too much. I'm, uh, mm, I won't. Honestly, mm, I won't watch it. Uh, uh, mm, mm. Be careful. You know. Be so, careful. but okay. I'm from the school of. <laughs> Kale needs to apologize. She does. She needs to apologize. And she said, "I'm sorry." And the funny thing is, like with the scoop thing, I don't know how hard she came down on him. Do I think Snoop should have addressed her in that fashion? No, because the way yeah. he just ripped her, he it did. was uncalled for. It was uncalled but for. But at the same time, he is the king of itches and hoes. So, yeah. so but yeah. you want you would hope people grow out of that. Your yeah. grandfather now, your uncle Scoop. So that tongue lashing that he gave to her like that, yeah. he could have reeled it back. But Gail, pull up with yeah. an apology. It's not cute. <laughs> not knowing. Thank you so much for joining us. You can leave a comment. Uh, we love to hear from you. If I heart you, that does mean that I saw it. Mm -hmm. Have a great afternoon and morning or, or whenever you're, you you're, you're, you're watching us. Mm -hmm. Have a good one. <laughs> Bye.